Hello once again everybody, welcome back to 4 Play Games, this is Randomizer with Viscera Cleanup Detail. So you know when you're playing a game, when you're rushing through a sci-fi facility killing all the aliens, yeah, someone's got to clean all that up, and that's our job, so let's get started shall we? Uh, just a solo game, uh, we're going to do Unrefinery, because it's a small and quick level. <laughs> So here we go, small and quick level. Our job is to clean this place up and open it for business again. So, a dilapidated oil refinery was victim to a recent incident. Unknown mantis entities appear to have made it from below the surface where they were disturbed by facility operations. Yes, that will probably happen if something lives underground and you're digging or drilling for something. They've almost certainly all been terminated by this point, surely. <laughs> As always, company protocols stipulate that you should operate efficiently and with discretion in carrying out your custodial duties. Yes, indeed. So, um, the key to this game is being methodical. So, um, yes. Dead body right there. And I've got some screen tearing going on. Never mind. <laughs> I normally put V-Sync on, but there we go. Uh, so, yes. No, this is where we come in, there's all sorts of trash, there's these boxes and these um, these barrels to put somewhere. Now as we walk around you'll notice that we start to leave footprints everywhere, which is fantastic. Oh dear, Ugh, look at that, it's disgusting. And this is where we punch out at the end of the shift. <laughs> so uh, yes. All this sort of stuff, right. Every single one of these bullet casings needs picking up. Every single one of these boxes, all the trash, all the body parts. Uh, medical kits need to be put back. Oh, there's so much stuff to do. And this is a small map, by the way. This is one of the smallest maps you can get. And it is just huge. Who thought what the huge one would be? right <laughs> so if we just grab our hands here now then we've got a little red outline here this is crates right so these are already here that's fine so we need to get rid of these ones like that we'll have to go and retrieve that in a bit never mind but there we go so we have our we can dispense these bins, which help us uh, put things away. We can get new buckets of water here. Where is our incinerator? Ah, that's over here. Fantastic. Our incinerator is over here, right next to this thing here, which is for barrels. So, yeah, you're going to have to be a bit careful here. So, I'll open that. Can we pick this thing up? Yes, we can. We can just get rid of that straight away. Now it's left click to um, to put something back up again. So we have that. Left click to put it back upright. And it'll be right click to put it down. Unfortunately there's all this stuff in the way. And put that there. There we go, you see? You see, it's quite easy. There's just an awful lot of work to do. An awful lot of work to do. Especially uh, here, where we really need to clean this zone up first, I would think. So we've got a box. We've, we've um, <laughs> we got a box here. So we can try and put some stuff in. Nah, that's that's too big. <laughs> that's just too big to uh, go in a box. So we better carry these things manually. Really should leave the door open, to be honest. Um. Yeah, leave the door open. So we'll get these body parts out of the way. We'll uh, do a little bit of mopping up just to make sure everything's clean before we start putting things away. So that's fine, so we'll grab our bucket of water. Make sure we don't spill it. Go back to Mr. Mop. And then... Uh, ee -ee -ee, ee -ee -ee. Now you've got to be very careful not to um, 
not to get your mop too dirty because otherwise you just just spread the dirt around that's what the bucket's for so clean 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 and uh, refresh the mop there we go clean the wall a bit more there we go is that a bit of gunk? yes it is there's a bullet hole there so that will need to be fixed yes indeed but at least if we can get some of this crap mopped up everything will be fine <laughs> oh look we've got some entrails there lovely let's just see if we can get all of this all of this bloody mess uh, put away let's stand on the clean bit now so we should have clean feet now not for much longer but we should have relatively clean feet <laughs> our feet will eventually stop um, leaving footprints are we done? yes we are fantastic there we go I believe that's um, yeah that's that's ready to be disposed of that needs to go in there you'd think you'd just be able to dump the water out wouldn't you but no every now and again these machines will spit out a um, body parts or something that you'll have to pick up instead of um, <laughs> that you'll have to pick up and get rid of because they'll leave a big mess everywhere as well so yeah these little buckets here are perfect for all these little teeny tiny objects Let's see there's oh yeah there's more there's more. Yes, this, this does take some time. I believe there was something hiding under there. Yes, there was. Aha. Got you. Not quite. No, I don't want to pick the bucket up. There we go. That works. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear. All right. And that in there. Now this of course will probably take me an hour or two to actually clean, so I'm not going to do it all today. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if there's anything behind there that needs um, that needs cleaning, because they usually do something like that, just to mess with you. Well, uh, just move this out of the way a bit first, I think. There we go. The problem is, is that you can get a little bit motion sick in this game. Especially if you're, well, not the one controlling it. <laughs> That's still mostly within the zone, isn't it? Anything hiding? It all looks clean back here, doesn't it? Yes. That all looks clean. Mostly. <laughs> yeah, it's mostly clean. It's fine. Leave that there as long as you don't roll away. You're within the zone. You can stay there. That's fine. Now, what other tools do we have? We've got a sniffer. We've got our personal log. Ah, oh, so we don't have a... We don't have our welding device. That'll be in the map somewhere. That will be in the map somewhere. Anyway, let's grab these, these big bits. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to tidy up this bit here. I'm not going to bother with down there. And I'm not going to bother down there either. There's a load of stuff down there. Ah, there's the welder. Oh, you actually, you actually get rid of it, do you? I see. Right, well, there's a, a mop there as well. Anyway, yeah, let's get, let's get rid of all the big bodies first. Oh, look at all of these. So many of them. It's all disgusting. It's the noise. It's the noise as much as anything, you know. There we go. Got this guy's legs in there. <laughs> Impromptu cremation. I hope your family doesn't want your body back. 
Oh dear, I missed. It's on fire. In we go. You are in, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> so, uh, I'll leave your head till last, mate. So yes, this is basically why you do all the all the messy bits first. Because otherwise you're running around and uh, just tracking footprints everywhere as you're trying to do everything else. This is um, one of those little ID chips that you need to take to the clock out machine so that you can end your shift. I don't know where that's gone. There it is. <laughs> So that um, they can end their shift. There we go. That's him logged out. <laughs> uh, he won't be paid for the rest of his shift now. Uh, I should really... Um... Right, so we've got, got all the little bits. Let's get all the little bits from over here. The ones we can put in the box. Right, so we've got all the shells. We've got all the little tiny bits. There's some more shells over here. Is everything gone from over there? I think so. Yeah, let's be careful. And stuff fell out. Never mind. We'll pick that up again later. Grab and put. Grab. Put in there. Oh, we've got a we've got a log book. Let's have a read of the log book. I recommended the immediate dumping of our last batch. If my analysis was correct, and it always is, we were showing a 23% deficit in purity. It gets worse. The tests show traces of organic compounds, living tissue. I thought maybe it's a dead co-worker. I mean, accidents happen, but no deaths have been reported, nor staff are accounted for. As soon as the batch has been dumped, I'm recommending security search the tanks, tunnels, pipes, everything. Yeah. Oh, no, that's the, the wrong button. Well, uh, we'll get rid of evidence of what happened here. Dump that in there. There we go. <laughs> right. We're all mostly clean around here now. Oh, there's a, a fair amount of stuff down there. Fair amount of stuff down there. Come on. In the top. There we go. No, I don't want the container. I want the bag of crisps. Go on. There we go. <laughs> Can of drink that's still sealed by the look of it. Anyway, let's pick up these bullet casings. You do love the noise they make. <laughs> So I'm going, just going to go up to the door, I think. Just in the doorway. And that'll be enough. All these little bits. Ah. See, it's a very satisfying game. Actually cleaning. <laughs> actually cleaning this place and tidying up. Come on, up we go. We do not want things to fall out. Grab that. Put that in there. I think this is full enough now. Come on, can we can we walk? There we go. Walk that in there. And we'll get ourselves another bin. Lovely. Put that over here and grab all these bits. Come on, get in there. Get in there, that's it. So I can't believe how old this game is, because I, I was looking at the information screen while it started up. It's 2013, it's a 10-year-old game now. It seems like an awful lot of my games are from that era. <laughs> it's like, it's almost as if I haven't really bought many games that came out in the last, like, five years or so. I mean, I know I have. Of course I have, just not many, that's all. So, oh yeah, we've still got some bullet casings around here. Oh look, top brass. <laughs> you get an achievement for picking them up. 
See, I've, I've played, according to Steam, I've played about 50 hours of this now. Some levels take about six hours to do, bear in mind. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's ridiculously long. Okay. Do you have much back here now? Somebody really likes Chinese food. There's an awful lot of those containers around here. Chinese food and crisps. Oh, we've got a note. Plumbing inspector. So we're being told to search the plumbing. Supposedly for something alive. I don't know what the hell is going on, but this sucks. Do they think I enjoy crawling around in horribly greasy pipes covered in God only knows what? I just hope there's no sudden backwash like last week. Oh dear. That sounds like a whole story. <laughs> So yeah, there's, there's quite a bit of story behind these um, behind these things. So do we have any more? Well, we've got a couple of bits over here, don't we? Yeah. I should really take that over there, but there's only a few bits. It's fine. Right, there we go. And into the incinerator we go. I shouldn't need to incinerate anything else apart from buckets when I finish mopping up. Right? Okay. So we put we put the barrels over there. These things have to go over here. So yeah, that's gonna be an awful lot of walking around now to uh, put these things away which means that yes I'm going to have to um, I'm going to have to keep keep track of where all my footprints are and make sure I don't leave too many footprints down here before I, I deal with them <laughs> ah, you know maybe, maybe I should mop up before I start walking all over the place I don't know Maybe I will, maybe I won't. I'm fine for now. I'm fine as long as I keep on top of things. Alright, so there we go. That's a, that's a big one. Yeah, we're getting some... Um, nope, I want my mop, please. There we go. Let's just clean it. Just make sure this area is nice and clean before we... Uh, before we go in again, there we are. I don't particularly care if I'm leaving footprints now, as long as I'm not leaving footprints under stuff that I'm putting there. <laughs> right, that has given me access to the barrel location over there. Let's put that back up. Let's see if we can stack them somewhat. Because, yeah, there's um, there's blood on the walls here. I'm going the wrong way. Ah, I can just press the number buttons to switch. That's cool. And yes, that has already saturated my my mop. Already saturated my mop. Never mind. I'll, I'll take this with me. Great. So, time to incinerate this. Open. Open. That's it. And in you go. <laughs> Let's get another bucket. Now, you see these plates on the floor? I don't know if you're supposed to throw those away. I think you might very well be. Never mind. Take this over here. We'll... I think we'll, we'll mop. We'll mop. It's, um, it's a bit too messy right now, I think. <laughs> a bit too messy. Make sure we don't create a huge mess with a, a dirty broom. Oh look, there's bits there as well. Can we um, shove them off the... that's it. Shove them off the platform, get them out of the way. <laughs> so we've run around a bit now, see if we can 
get rid of our footprints. Black, black, black. Mop, mop, mop. Splash, splash. <laughs> oh, look at this. It's looking cleaner already. It's looking so much cleaner already. Great. Oh, it's really, really bloody over in this corner. Really bloody in this corner. Look at this. Look at this. It's everywhere. And this is empty. This is uh, done. I'll just get another one. We'll uh, switch. Switch that. Grab another one. We'll put them away later. It's fine. Grab that one. Put it in there. There we go. And back to mop in. Splash, splash, splash. Leaving a bit of mess now. There we go. How the hell do you get mess up there? Really? It's splashing everywhere. All this disgusting blood and guts. Are we all done over here? <laughs> well, it looks fairly done to me. I'm still leaving some footprints, but never mind. As long as we get most of this stuff done, it'll be fine. Uh, it's all covered in blood now. Splash, splash. We've got clean walls now. Yes, let's work on the floor. Ah, it looks so much better now that it's getting clean. Footprint. And that's full of gunk again. Yeah, the, the the buckets don't last long. Unfortunately. Never mind. Get another one. Did I see some shells on the floor? Yes, I did. Fantastic. There are more shells. Quite a few more shells, actually. Where were you earlier? Where were you earlier? I didn't notice you before. You're covered in gunk, that's why. Anyway, you're gone now. <laughs> splash, splash, splash. Some footprints over there. We'll uh, work backwards. As long as you're methodical, it does a good job. Sure, we're all done around here. Are we still leaving footprints? Yeah, we still got dirty feet. That's fine. Clean our footprints. There's a bit of a splash there. Lovely. A bit of a splash over there. Some footprints. Yeah, we're, we're, we're definitely making progress. We are definitely making progress. And it's been about 25 minutes now. So, um,. I'll do what I can do, and then we'll, we'll just end it. I think all I'm going to... I'm not going to put the, the stuff away. I'm just going to finish mopping up, I think. Oh, great. That's dirty again. Let's get rid of this. Get another bucket. You can see why people get motion sick. Oh, here we go. This is going to... Yeah. Lovely. Thank you. Thank you for giving me some gristle that I'm going to have to get rid of now. So give that a good old clean. Did I just kick something down there? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Doesn't really matter. Splash, splash, splash. Yes, of course I'm leaving footprints. I've got dirty feet. And I've kicked that everywhere. Fantastic. 
<sighs> Another bucket, please. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dearie me. Right. Clean. Clean, clean, clean. Okay, we're all clean around there. Let's get rid of this bucket that we don't need anymore. I don't really need you two anymore, but you're fine by there. Clean up all these footprints. Who's been walking on my nice clean floor? Oh, that was me. <laughs> See if we can um, see if we can push the cleanliness in that direction, shall we? <laughs> no, that's it. Come on, there we are. That's the floor clean at least. Gotta work on the walls now. So much dirt, so much grime, so many bullet holes. Oh, there's a bit more dirt up there, look. Anything on this wall? I think this wall's clean. Yeah, it's not too bad, is it? Okay, that needs getting rid of. In there. Head over, get another bucket. Uh, <laughs> well, we get dirty feet and everything. Right. Splash, splash, splash. Right. I think it's time that we at least demonstrated some of these. How to get rid of some of these. Go away. There's a bit of dirt down there. Never mind. How we get rid of some of these? Uh, some of these bullet holes. You've got to be fairly careful, because if you if you aim at them too long, you end up igniting a small fire and it goes everywhere. So one there, I think there's one up there as well. I've got no um, I've got no crosshair. I just realised oh, that's the wrong button. There we go. Right. <laughs> yeah, there are a few more footprints down there to get rid of. Lovely. Oh, look, there's another hole there. Never mind. That was only to demonstrate what you do. Anyway, we'll clean up over here. That's nice. We clean over there. Clean, clean, clean. Everything's looking much cleaner now. <laughs> Everything's looking so much cleaner now. I mean, I'm not doing a, a full job, not by any stretch of the imagination. It's, it would take far too long. It would take far too long to do a full and proper job. I mean, for instance, I'm not doing... Um, I'm not filling in the report for every single person. <laughs> I'm not going through cause of death and where he was and what happened to him and all the rest of that. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. That's far too much work. Now, are we relatively clean up here? Yeah, we're relatively clean up here. I mean, it's still untidy, but we've we've mopped up. We've mopped up. <laughs> yeah, so I think that is going to be... Um, that's going to be the end of it for today. So, a really good game. Very satisfying to try and reach 100% completion on each level. It does take a long time and a lot of work. There's, um, there's a lot of gameplay value here, I think. So, anyway, that's a yay from me. Thanks very much for watching. If you liked it, remember to subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.